Leonard Euler, one of the world's leading mathematicians of the 18th century. Born in 1707 near Basel, Switzerland, Euler's father was a Lutheran pastor and he wanted him to follow in his footsteps. So at the age of 13, he was sent to the University of Basel to study theology. This is where he met one of Europe's leading mathematicians, John Berulli, who influenced him to take up the study of mathematics. By 1723, Euler earned his first master's degree. And by 1727, at the age of only 19, he won a prize from the Académie des Sciences for an arrangement of ship masts. Then Euler wanted to be a professor at a university. Upon recommendation, he was contacted by the Academy of St. Petersburg in Russia. On his very first day in Russia, the academy was nearly broken up when the Empress Catherine I died. And this is when Euler joined the Russian Navy. In 1730, he almost achieved lieutenancy in the Russian Navy when he was contacted by the Academy of St. Petersburg once again, and then he took a position as a professor of physics. Shortly after that, Euler became ill and lost sight in one eye. In 1741, he left Russia and accepted the position as Director of Mathematics at the Berlin Academy in Germany. After spending about 25 years in Berlin, he returned to the Academy of St. Petersburg, and shortly after his return to Russia, he lost sight in his remaining good eye, and it's said that after he lost all of his eyesight, he produced most of his most famous works. And finally, in 1783, while playing with his grandchildren, he suddenly suffered from a brain hemorrhage and died. Throughout his lifetime, Euler wrote and or took part in over 700 books and papers. One of Euler's well-known works was written in 1770 known as The Complete Instruction in Algebra. It was published in many editions of English, Dutch, French, Italian, and Russian and gave algebra the form that it retains even today. 